Yo, how's it going guys? Rebel here, coming to you guys with a brand new video, episode number 48 of the RTG. And today, we're going to be rebuilding our club, or at least attempting to. I'm going to show you how to build up your club. If you just completely rinse through SBCs during Team of the Year, if you did Icon SBCs and your club is just barren, I'm going to show you how to get started so you get your club back to that level where it once was. But before we get into it, go ahead and leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more FIFA 21 content. We upload every single day. And uh, yeah, just subscribe, follow the Twitch if you want to see us all live. We play Weekend League, we do... We we just have some fun on there man so just do all that we've been grinding 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 and uh let's get straight to it so this is our team as you guys saw yesterday in our video we did get red carrasco i'm very very happy with that honestly because we had his inform there tradable anyway so we just sold that version and then we bought this we got this one for free everybody on this team is untradable except for rashford and i'm making money on him i got him for 37k uh if we take a look at him right now i think he's actually going for 40k uh, which is a big fat w let's see a little bit more yeah he's going for like 43 i could probably sell him for 43 make a nice little six 5k profit something like that but we're gonna hold on to him for now um or we might actually sell him we might actually sell him because tomorrow is future stars and i know Sokka's is gonna get a card but it if it's right winger or left winger we're gonna see hopefully it's like a right winger but uh that carrasco is kind of a killer man because we are be gonna be picking up onto fati when he comes out I really hope he's under 1.5 mil. If he's under 1.5 mil, we'll scoop him up right away. If he's like 2 mil or something, we're going to have to wait for a little bit. But, um, dude, like this card right here already looks nice with that dribbling and like that pace and stuff. I can't imagine how his new card's going to look outside foot shot trade as well. I just hope, hope, hope he gets a game face soon. I really want him to get a game face soon. Um, and then we could get Des to Rajo in here. Rooney's going to have to leave the club. We're going to have to bring Suarez in there. Him and Eto up top. I don't know. We're going to have to figure some stuff out. I, I even forgot we had Ja Felix. But you guys aren't here for that. You're here to see how to rebuild your squad, how to rebuild your team. So I'm sitting right now at 2.3 mil. Now, I would say to begin rebuilding your team, your squad, your club, you need to have at least like 100k. And how do you get that 100k first? Well, you could snipe. Look at my past videos. Join the Discord. I have some sniping filters on there, some investments. I did do an investment where I told some people to buy the striker center forward um literally for 2k around like three weeks ago and if you look at this position modifier now it's literally extinct at like 5k so um they made a lot of money on that but uh discord's a great place to so make some coins so i'd say start with 100k and the first stuff you want to do man is just get your club value up my club value right now is not looking the best if we take a look at that um because we have also just destroyed our club by putting them into spcs our players uh, icon spcs player spcs like that dybala the rooney and a uh, mid icon spc um as well as those premium league upgrades stuff like that so we're sitting at 5.5 mil transfer profit uh weekly we've made 300k this week and if we look at club value we are very 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 low we're on the bottom almost uh 71 mil uh, club value that's horrible we want to be at, sitting at like 300 mil 300 mil is a great anything above 200 mil is a great great club value how do you get that up that's how much your club is worth altogether so i was almost about to open this we're saving packs for uh future stars so if you want to check that out come into the stream tomorrow uh right when future stars, stars drops and we're going to try to pack some i hope 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 we get somebody good um but like I said, to build your club back up, start with bronzes. Start with bronzes. You know, just keep opening them, ripping them open, ripping them open, and ripping them open. Store every single thing that you get into the club. Uh, and celebration, sell for 200 coins each. It, it might not sell on the first one, but just, you know, list them like that. And then, once you start opening a bunch of bronzes, guys, you're going to want to put all the dead bronzes in the dead leagues. Like the English 4, four League, English 3 League, Romanian League, Switzerland League, um uh what other like i'm trying to think uh korean league all those type of players put those into the bronze upgrades and then from that you're gonna get silver cards now you could also just do bronze pack method straight up and you could that's like a 200k thing you could just straight up sell every single thing you get in bronze packs but i like to store everything i get and uh let me give you guys an example real quick of what i do so once i get a lot of bronzes into the club i'd say once i spend 50k on bronze packs you're going to have to spend quite a bit to get it started, but don't worry. You're going to make your coins back. You're going to get your, a healthy club for the cheapest price possible. Uh, and then you're just going to give up all those dead league bronzes that I was telling you guys about, right? So all these bronzes that are from a league that aren't league SBCs, like the Ireland, 
uh, Romania, English 3, like I was talking about right here, English 4, even Argentina, Argentina doesn't have one, Mexico does have a league, Saudi Arabia does as well, Argentina like that, Denmark, Japan, uh, Japan again, all these players, you're going to give them up into this SBC, and in this SBC, you're going to get two players, you're going to get two silver players, one rare, one non-rare, this is going to help you build up your squad, for uh certain SBC, so like the the West Brom SBC in the Premier League, that SBC costs like 150k just because the silvers are extinct at around like uh 10k. They're literally going for 10k. So if you pack one, he goes up for 10k. And we actually did pack one. We packed the Nigerian West Brom center back. I'll show you real quick, just so you guys could see. But he goes for 10k. He's untradeable, of course, but when it comes to the time to actually, when the time comes to actually do the West Brom SBC, we're saving ourselves 10k uh, on that dude. So here we go, West Brom. Uh, we got this guy, a J. A J's right here. He probably goes for around. Let's take a quick look, real quick. He's extinct, so he's going for 10k. He's not tradable, but we're saving ourselves 10,000 coins. So you're going to want to keep doing that and doing that and doing that. Uh, you're going to pack some players. You might not get some right away, but you'll get some players. Trust me. And once you do, uh, that's our two silver players pack. Then you're going to look and to start doing league SPCs. Okay. And once you start doing league SPCs, that's where your club, it just starts getting better and better and better. You're going to get a bunch of untradeables, a bunch of tradables as well. It's up to you if you want to sell those tradables or just store them in the club. Right here, this guy is a dead league, Japanese league, dead league. But in this one, we get uh, Tijuana Cholos, Yurisar. I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, but what do, what do you do with the rares or the commons that are dead, right? The dead commons, silvers, you put those in the silver upgrades to get your three common gold players. But they're the dead league silvers, remember. You do that. And then the rare silvers, you have to go to the icon section uh, right here. Look for an icon that you haven't completed quite yet. Um, so for, I think all of ours are all filled out. Kaka, Kaka right here. Okay, so say you want to do Kaka um, or Kaka. Exactly silver, 11 rare players. So you're going to give up all your rare silvers that are from dead leagues into this. Um, and the same thing with the silver commons for the silver upgrade. Now, it does sound a little confusing, but trust me, once you guys get the hang of it, it's, it's easy stuff. So as you guys see, English 3, German 2, French, English 4. And these packs are also a good way to get a lot of money back. And a good way of packing um, those very expensive silvers from League SBCs. I have packed some on here before. I packed some Leeds players and I sold them for like 20k. But what I do, if I get an expensive one, I just hold them. Because eventually he's going to go into an SBC anyway. So why not just, you know, hold them and uh, put them in there. Save yourself some coins. Because, you know, you're going to have to buy them eventually. But we have a lot of silvers. And this is all from grinding bronze pack method. And, uh, yeah, doing the bronze upgrades and stuff like that. It does take a while, guys. You're not going to get this overnight. You're not going to get this in two days. It'll probably take you straight up uh, maybe like a... Mm, okay, I'd say maybe 24 hours. Like, if you're up just all day grinding this, of course, you're going to get this done in 24 hours. Uh, your club will have over a 1,000 players probably, most likely, maybe even more. And your club will be looking very healthy for the next promo. I remember last week when... Uh, and then, you see, you just submit all your silvers. But I remember last week when... Um, team of the year was coming i had 200 players in my club during team of the year i had a thousand players that was just from grinding all this so now you open that jumbo silver pack and in that jumbo silver pack you're gonna get silver players and silver contracts and balls and jerseys and stuff like that so here we go we got this rare player if he's from a big club you know that's always good but let's just see uh tigres mesa that's actually a nice card he probably sells for like 1k and this is completely up to you guys but what i would do is just store them in the club completely up to you guys you could just sell them right here for profit and make all your profit off of this so mesa make like 500 coins off of him off of mario we'll make like uh 700 coins off of this guy we'll make like a 1k and as you guys see all that money that you guys spent on your um, bronze pack say you spent like 4k you're probably making all back off of these players so that's also very very good uh, i just realized i look kind of weird on this because i have my lights off um i thought it would look a little bit nicer it looks cool you know i look pretty cute but um swagger i don't know what that is but all the silver ones i list for 700 uh this kit probably sells for a little bit because i know there's some queretaro fans out there that want this jersey so let's just list it for 200 coins and then um yeah oh that's actually kind of a nice badge yeah we'll list that for 200 as well 
but those are all the silvers you're eventually going to hit a big player man i'm telling you and then you're just going to storm into your club or sell him once you guys um get all your silvers all your bronzes it's time to get your golds and like i said you get your golds from doing the silver upgrades so over here uh you go to upgrades you go to silver so you got your silvers you got your gold you got your bronzes from bronze pack method you got your silvers from the bronze upgrades now it's time to give up your silvers uh, silver comments and get those get those uh, little golds you need to get your golds right to complete some league SPCs. so to do that you do this again you look through your uh, silver commons dead leagues remember they have to be dead leagues they can't be major leagues all these right here you see are major leagues and everybody you see right here is not a major league so that fits perfect bam bam and we might have to spend a little bit if you have to spend some coins maybe like 200 100 coins uh, I recommend you do so but let's take a quick look if we could complete it without this put him there put him there mm, i don't think we're gonna be able to guys unless we give up this guy but i'm pretty sure he sells as well let's see how much he sells for moulin yeah we'll hold on to him let's see if we have any other silver commons so let's see turkish french one you don't want to give him up you know what we'll give up the, this english player because i really don't see us completing the championship anytime soon if we could give him up, we'll give him up right there. And then, um, let's see right here. Can we give somebody else up over here instead? There. Put him there. Do we have any other striker that we could give up? If not, we'll just buy a silver striker. Yeah, we'll just buy a silver striker. Um, let's go ahead and get that silver striker over here. So go silver striker, silver, 200 coins. Uh, buy literally any single one that's only 200 coins and then you're gonna yeah perfect perfect just like that we might actually save this guy too because that's from a port oh whoa, whoa whoa you don't want the computer turning off yeah you don't want to no that's fine we'll give that up and then you get three common golds and your three common golds those players are going to be good for uh for league sbcs that's how you're gonna get your golds and the most important way guys i wouldn't stress about getting golds that much is because as you guys see here we have a bunch of packs literally sitting here for future stars once i open these packs i'm gonna get an income of around like 300 to maybe 200 300 gold players into my club and that's gonna help me grind league SPCs even more so the hardest part realistically in my entire opinion my honest opinion is getting your silvers the silvers is the hardest part bronzes you can get them through silver pack or bronze pack method your silvers you know you have to rinse those upgrades you have to do silver pack method you have to do those icon upgrades it's very hard to get the silvers and those are usually the most expensive ones Another great way of getting your golds, guys, is to make sure you complete every single objective possible. I know I'm not one to talk because I don't really complete my objectives, but we're going to get started on this today. Um, I know that only is five packs, an Electrum Players pack, a Premium Gold pack, but that is still players. That's still around 20 to 30 gold cards that are going to be coming into your team. And let me give you guys an example, okay? So you're going to say this pack is not worth it. A 75 plus rated rare player. Okay, well, let's just say... Um, Let's just say you want to complete Rooney, right? And let's say you need that Manchester United player. And let's just say in that 75 rated player pack, you pack Maguire. Now let's take a look at how much Maguire actually costs you. If you were to buy him off the market. So Maguire, if you were to buy him off the market, is going for around 4K. If you pack this Maguire, you're saving yourself 4K. You're saving yourself 3.8K if you if you pack the Maguire. And you never know what else could be in that pack. You could get a CR7. You could get an Mbappe. I've seen CR7. I saw a team of the year Ronaldo get packed from that pack. And you never know. It's just very, very important to complete your objectives. That's a really good way of getting uh, golds into your club. Another great way of getting silvers and golds is just going into drafts and try your best. And um, maybe if you win it, you know, you get a good pack. If you lose first round, you get two silver packs, I believe, and two gold packs. So that's pretty good. You usually make your money back on that anyway off of players. But like like this, this Grealish, it'd be amazing if you complete this because you get five packs. That's like 30 golds. This, you don't get any packs for that. Silver Beast, if you complete this, you get five, uh, you get four 75 plus rated players. So that's four rare players. And then you get a rare mega pack at the end. That's like another 15 players. So that's 19 golds. If you complete this, two, 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 that's six. That's uh, eight players for this. La Liga players, same thing, eight players for that. You, you see what I mean? It's just a lot of players that get stacked up. And that's not even including the milestones. If you guys complete like uh, Rivals Mastery, 
if you guys uh complete the finishing one i don't know if you guys have completed this i completed this right away like literally the first week of fifa but if you guys haven't scored your 200 goals your 100 for nest shots um your 50 goals you know you're missing on easy packs um and that's for everything for co-op for all this for friendlies there's just so many ways to get packs in this game uh even squad battles division rivals foot champs foot draft like i said and you want to make sure that you complete your marking matchups as well uh for me example i need to complete my marking matchups i get a rare electrum players pack for that i get a premium electrum a jumbo premium a premium gold this is a really really good set of packs right here this is five packs that you're gonna get let's just say that's 10 players in each one that's another 50 gold players coming into your account um and that's that's lowballing it that's lowballing it so all together guys i'm probably gonna get around i'd say let's see that's 12 let's just say 12 12 12 12 12 i'd say i'm gonna probably gonna get around like probably 200 gold players uh tomorrow in my club by just opening these safe packs and I'm still going to grind bronze pack method. I'm still going to grind silver pack method. But um, yeah, you want to make sure, guys, that you're playing squad battles. Okay, because that's another easy, easy packs. Even though you don't do really good, that's easy packs that you're going to get back into your account. Division rivals, that's not that easy. But you know, that's still some packs, coins, stuff like that. Foot champs, if you play that, you get coins through that. Foot draft, I know you get a lot from that. Even single player draft, I've seen people pack icons through that. But the main, main, main thing is just make keeping track of your club, keeping track, making sure you're completing objectives, opening bronze packs. Um, bronze pack is like literally a foundation for all this stuff. Honestly, I'm not even kidding. Um, if you want to get a healthy, healthy club, you want to make sure you're doing bronze pack method, okay? And once you start doing bronze pack method, it's just easy, easy, smooth sailing from there. Uh, but you're just going to keep on going. So right here you have Via. Um, he probably goes for like 700 coins, honestly. I should say 700 um yeah he, he's a very real player so once we get around doing that you got three dead league players that would go into an upgrade so that's very nice send everything to your club quick sell that and as you guys see i'm sending all the bronze packs or bronze contracts into the club again so what do you want to do with that you want to go to uh transfer list and eventually you want to keep checking so every like thousand packs you open or 100 packs or something go to consumables right here go to contracts and you're gonna see bronze contracts okay look how many we have we have 587 if we were to quick sell them we'd get 1600 coins we're gonna go ahead and do that real quick so we get an easy 1600 coins for the managers we get 330 coins uh for the player contracts we're gonna get nothing for that for these contracts we're gonna get 768 coins uh same thing with your silvers if you want to do that with your silver cards go ahead and do that but i think the silvers are worth a little more so we're gonna hold on to these um yeah so as you guys see we went up 3k just by selling our bronze contracts and that's why you send everything because at the end you get a little you get a little reward you know you get a reward for selling everything um and doing bronze pack method i know when i used to do gold pack method every like 100 packs i opened i would look at my transfer list or my contracts and i would literally quick sell like 70k worth of uh contracts so that's something that's very important guys but literally it's very simple stuff make sure you get up to 100k start opening bronze packs do the upgrades like i showed you guys uh, make sure you're completing every single objective you know basically just playing the game if you just play rivals you're going to complete so many objective cards so many objectives that it's it's not even you know worth spending people points on the game and you got to also remember that season progress is here so um or the battle pass or whatever so the more you play the more you're going to get those like prime gold players packs you're going to get um rare electrum packs the 75 rated player packs but it's just very simple stuff guys very very simple ea makes it kind of easy for us to get to play the game to get a good team without spending fifa points honestly in my opinion that's one of the things i like a lot I, although they have nerfed it with league SBCs this year um you know it's still it's still okay it's still fun i'd rather do this and play the game i say this all the time but if you guys enjoyed the video leave a like i hope i helped you guys get some knowledge on how to build your club up um it took me a while to understand everything but once you guys start doing this and grinding it and applying it every single day you could literally open bronze packs while you're at like waiting for a doctor's appointment or something you're getting a covid test or something sit on your phone open like 10 bronze packs bam you know you could do it anywhere i used to do it when school was, school was open i used to sit in class sometimes and do that um or when you're just out you know bored in the living room open packs and it's a good way to keep your club healthy 
if you're that into it. If you're not really that into it, into grinding, you'd rather just spend a few points and this video wasn't for you anyway. But um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it, guys. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Actually, this stadium right here, America. America Stadium. So this sells for a lot. Uh, 1500 But yeah, more proof it works. I'll see you guys later. Peace.